and we are back thank you for joining us and let's start the boogie in boogie 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 i don't feel sleepy at all no i'm gonna walk into some domestic abuse only because i have to look for them Wait, it's the bedroom, right? Oh, okay, it's just repeating itself. So where are they? Are they in the living room? In the kitchen? You're nothing oh. but a stupid bitch. That's what you are. Don't call me that. Shut your damn gob woman. Hey! Do you know what the problem is? You! Nagging! Always nagging! So shut your stinking mouth, will you? John! I'm begging you. What's going but on? What did I just say? You fucking deaf or something? Hey! Hello? I haven't done anything Bethany's wrong! Bethany's crying again. Oh, you know bloody well what you did, Miranda. You For fuck's sake, aren't stinking you gonna do something? Bag of shite. Hello? You got it all wrong, John! Stupid. Hello? See, that's what I'm talking about. Hello? You're nothing but a stupid bitch. Hello? That's... Stab him with some headphones! What you are? She said headphones on, John. Don't call me that! Hello? Shut your damn gob woman. Do you know what the problem is? <laughs> you! Oh, this is awkward. Is it locked? What the fuck? It's locked. Yeah, what? What? Mother sleeps in there with that man, and maybe it's locked. Um, what's going on? What? What's going Dad on? gave it to Mum for Christmas seven years ago. I bet she doesn't even remember. All right, what's going on, mates? Oh, okay then. Guess we feel trapped. Oh, okay. I'm so glad you're here, babes. I've got this splitting headache. Is your head and Beth off, screaming her head off again? Please tend to her for me, would you? It's all those cigarettes you smoke that give you headaches. But fine. I'll go. You just sit here and have another fag. Oh. Okay. Lever will extend the bridge so I can get to Bethany. Perhaps pressing this button will extend the bridge so I can get to Bethany. Oh god, there's a lot of things. Perhaps pressing this button, perhaps pulling this lever will extend the bridge know. so I can get to Bethany. Oh. Oh. What have you done? I don't know. It's what? the wrong lever, Lorelai. Well, am I supposed to know that? Oh, 
Then you do something, bitch! Bethany! Oh no! No. Okay. I'm just gonna casually walk. <laughs> Zack? Hello? Morning, Lorelei. Do you know what time it is? It's like... Six in the morning. Yeah. I... Stayed up. I got something for you. What is it? It's... Um... Well, they said it would rain today. So I thought I'd give you this. Oh, An umbrella. And it's, it's black and red. Yeah. Aww. I thought, well, you don't really want to get drenched on your first day of work. I love it. Thanks. I hope it brings you luck. That's very sweet of you, Zach. You really stayed up all night just to give me an umbrella? Aww. Nah, you know me. I do stuff at night all the time. Like what? All sorts of stuff. <laughs> Programming, mostly. And other boring things like that. And I had like three episodes of Game of Thrones to catch up on. <laughs> so I watched that. <laughs> when do you sleep? I'll go to bed in about... two minutes. <laughs> Lucky you. Right. I'm off. I don't want to be late. See you later, Zach. Are we just gonna stand? Okay. Keys. <laughs> now keys. Oh, God, it's yeah. Do you? Um, you know, it's, uh, forget it, it's nothing, really. Aw, that's ask you out. Have a great day, yeah? Che cheerio. He wanted to ask you out, he wanted to ask you out. Uh, 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 meh. That didn't actually scare me, I don't know, there was nothing there to really... Oh, not again! So, I guess this is in the future, and we've moved out... Because, fuck that place... Or something... Why are we going through... Oh, no... Oi! You dickhead! Interesting. Put the bubble down! Don't hurt her. She's not giving me any choice. She's holding some fucking secret and I want to know it. Eh? It's a bubble. You you're better than me. Do you think I'll hesitate? To Whoa! <laughs> Holy! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> It was just a dream. <laughs> that was horrendous! <laughs> oh my god! Whoa. Whoa. What? Two dreams? Maybe I'm being too tough on Mum. Jesus. I'll try to talk to her one more time. That's fucking crazy. So, wait. What? <laughs> if we go into the future? I'm so confused. Well, she must... That's a bit weird if it wasn't the case. Um... Unless she's going back dreaming? I don't know what's happening.
They're still up? What time is it? Yeah, if you had, don't like baby violence, you really don't want to, um... Yeah. Watch this. <clears throat> that was crazy. Oh. Where is she? Hello? Maybe later. I've only just come back. Where is she? Is she in the bathroom? Maybe? It leads to the hallway. The bathroom? She was watching a movie, so she might have just gone to pee. Let's go see. Maybe pee? Maybe peeing. Maybe she went to go pee. Did she go to go pee? Oh, okay. Mom. Hey. Okay? I want to be alone. Do you mind? Did something happen? No, nor am I. It's nothing. I just need a minute. It's about John, isn't it? What? No. I'm just not feeling well. I'll be fine in a minute. Actually, no. I'll tell you the truth. Do you want to hear it? Yeah, of course. Yes. I hate this life. I hate waking up to the sound of Beth crying. I hate John drinking all the time. He's drunk all the money we've had left till the end of the month. Did you know? We're broke. I hate this stinking old flat. I hate this bloody rain. Just raining all the time. I can't even take Beth out, so we stay at home and she's bored and she's being a fucking nightmare. And <laughs> I hate your nagging. That disappointed face you make every time I feel shit. Yes, Lorelai. I even hate you. Um, wow. No, I'm not taking Beth for call. <laughs> I'm sorry, but no! I, I want to be sympathetic! I'll sing and walk away. I probably would do that if it was my own mother saying that to me, to be honest. Be like, bye then, I guess. Uh... Yeah, let her know she's seriously fucking upset me. knew what to do. He'd have said, imagine there's a secret door right here in your room.
but it's right in front of you, Lord. Probably the most beautiful place in the world. Right here. Give me one of your riddles, Dad. A riddle, eh? All right. Listen up. My mirror image is never that far. I have five different points, like a star. While I have no mouth that I can employ, I do make a song when filled with joy. What am I? Uh. My mirror image is never that far. I have five different points like a star. Well, I have no mouth that I can employ. I do make a sound when filled with joy. Ah, uh, a hand has five points, like a star. And it doesn't have a mouth. Mirror image is never that far. It could be. Ah, no, it no, that makes sense. Okay, so my my mirror image, obviously, because there's two of them. Uh, they obviously have five points. While I have no mouth that I can employ, I do make a sound when filled with joy, as in a clap. Right, I'm gonna say hand. Too easy, Dad. The answer is hand. You caught it. Yes. You are a clever young lady, aren't you? Taught you well. You're gonna get well, Dad. I know it. Oh, my. I saw it on TV. People be cancer all the time. Oh, that's what happened. Well, Dr. Myers is a great oncologist, they say. So who knows? It's gonna be a hell of a ride, though. For Mum. And for you as well. He left because he died. Okay. Right. You're big enough to deal with it. I know you are. It's always the biggest killer. And yeah, I had a feeling. But how can you deal with your dad dying from cancer when you're just 12 years old? You can't. Oh, man. For fuck's sake! Come out and apologize to me right now! For what? <clears throat> Miranda! Oh, it's just about to get real. What's going on? You sorry old mother who went and locked the door. Didn't I tell you both not to do that? Why? Leave her alone. I'm a bloody husband. Come out and talk to your husband. Miranda! Ah! <laughs> ah! Both go to hell. Hey, what I do? You will have a good chat about this when you come out, you stupid cow. Mom? 
Mom. You okay in there? She's killed us Mom! all. Mom. Oh God. It's not funny. Oh God. Please say something. I'm. I'm really getting worried now. Yeah, me too. Something's wrong. Yes, it is. I can feel it. I need to get this door opened. But how? Mom's locked it from the inside. Um. Maybe Zach will know what to do. Wait, what? Why would. S oh, online friend? Do we have a computer? Do we have a neighbor? Zach was the guy from the, who gave us the umbrella in the, like, what felt like a, a future thing. So. Where is Zach then? He's just dead wood too. Okay. I think she's either taken pills or cut herself. Um. Is there a phone or something somewhere I can use? Oh, it's saved. Probably a neighbor. Let's go find a neighbor. Oh! Bloody hell, I thought... Of course we're in an apartment. I was so confused. I thought we were in the future. And she moved out. Right, okay, that makes more sense to me now. So we must have got that a while ago, then. Well, I'm dumb. <laughs> Zach. My mum. I think something happened to her. What? Why? She was pretty upset tonight. We had a fight. Then I nodded off in my room, and that idiot John woke me up, banging on the door like a maniac. Mum locked herself in the bathroom, and I feel something's wrong. Like she's hurt or something. Please, Zach. I don't know what to do. Maybe... She just wants to be alone. No, I know her. She would just yell at me to go away. But she's saying nothing at all. That's not like her. Right. What if she fainted? We need to call an ambulance. An ambulance? We don't know until we get the situation done. Let me tell you something about my family. We are scum. The flat is in such a state. If the ambulance comes, they'll see all that shit. Do you understand? They'll put my little sister in a foster home. And I'll never see her again. Shit. My mom is crazy. My stepdad is a stinking drunk who keeps perving on me. I heard he sells weed to kids at school. Yeah, I know. But you're not like them. Look. We're wasting time. Please, help me get the bathroom open so we can see if she's alright. Okay. We're gonna pick the lock. We just need a screwdriver and some wire. All right. Sounds good. Have you ever done it before? Sure. Lots of times. In Skyrim. <laughs> In Skyrim. <laughs> Are you sure he's not gonna wake up? No. No. <laughs> That's the bathroom. Cool. Now I need a screwdriver and some wire. Like a paperclip or something. 
Wait. You don't have it. Um, no. I don't believe I do. Well, that's just great. I thought you were the lockpicking expert. An adept at most. But I can do it. I just figured you'd have a screwdriver at home. Most people do. Does it look like we do a lot of DIY around here? But wait. Dad had this cool Swiss army knife. I'm pretty sure it had a screwdriver in it. Can you find it? I think Mom put it away with the rest of his stuff. Hide in my room and wait for me. I'll go and have a look. Your room? Yes. Okay. Go in there, Zach! Sure. This is so weird about going into a girl's All room, right. I don't understand. A screwdriver and a wire. Just go into the room, bruh! It's too hard to find. It's fine! She cool with it! But unfortunately, that's all I have time for today. Next episode, we're gonna get into that bathroom and find out what the fuck is going on, bruh! Have a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night!